what's going on, Internet? Zyadix here, coming at you with another Mega Man Battle Network 6 video here. Last time, Dad got arrested. For no reason. I mean, we've got to prove his innocence. Hey, I need to talk to Mr. Mock here, right? Uh, what's the matter, Lan? Sir, I heard the board was going underground... Ma uh, wait. I got... I heard the board was undergoing maintenance yesterday, right? Do you remember what kind of person made those repairs? It wasn't my... It wasn't my dad, was it? Dad? Yeah, it was your dad. An older guy, right? Old? Maybe he was younger? Actually, I was so busy I didn't pay attention. Sorry. Okay. What time did the maintenance occur? It was around 3 o'clock yesterday, and it took about 2 hours. So 2 hours from 3 o'clock means he was here at 4 p.m. If we can prove Dad did the maintenance on the blackboard, we can prove that he's innocent. But how can we prove that Dad is innocent? The teacher who asked for his service doesn't remember his face. Don't give up so easily. Let's see what we can find in the old, in the school. Someone must have seen Dad here. Seen Dad. Seen. What's the matter? You've been asking a lot of questions. Something bothering you, Lynn? I'm okay, thanks. Well, if you're okay... Alright, I wonder if maybe... Maybe the... Yeah, there should be... We could probably find proof on the... Whoops, wrong room. Probably proof in the cameras. Hopefully, I really hope, I swear to God, if somebody scrubbed it, I'm going to be pissed. The camera is always filming your classroom, and then it saves the data here on the computer. So then, Mega Man, if we check the footage from around 4 p.m. yesterday, yeah, maybe Dad will be on it. And then that means Dad can't be the real criminal. I would, they would support his alibi. That's right. Don't you think we shouldn't have gotten his, again, we shouldn't have gotten his alibi before he was even prosecuted. Pretty sure that's how it works. Let's find that footage. Got it footage from 4 p.m. yesterday. Um, huh. That's strange. What's up, Mega Man? Frickin' virus, of course. Well, let's try out the newly... Uh, oh, great. Another another frickin' virus back from the dead. Try out the new... Actually, another something else I want to do. And we did... We tried the slash cross yesterday, but something else I want to try. I want to get rid of that eye quick. It's gonna be a pain in the butt, isn't it? Now, is, does it act like a wide sword then? Alright. Next. We have B slash or, or slash. I don't know. Um, what do you use? How about something that'll heal? Holy crap, he looks freaking amazing. Okay, heal up. Um, yeah, but then that means I can't use a slash move anymore. This will finish him off quickly. First, I gotta heal. Alright. Die! There we go. What was that? Where'd that virus come from? Nothing was... <laughs> Wait, nothing was strange at first, but when I started looking for the recording recorded data from 4 o'clock yesterday, virus popped out and started to attack me. What does that mean? It means it was probably a trap, but anyway, about that evidence, the data from around 4 o'clock yesterday is gone. Gone? What's that supposed to mean? Who in the world? It was probably the real culprit. The real criminal is probably trying to frame Dad. That's gotta be it. If there was data in, the, in Dad's, if there was data of Dad in this classroom at the time of the crime, then he couldn't be the real culprit. That's why the and that's why the data is missing, and that and the virus that was, wait, and that virus was to get rid of anyone who realized this. I think you're right. You think that the court, I mean, the guy in the court yesterday could be the real culprit? Well, we shouldn't jump to conclusions, but that could be one piece of evidence that can back up Dad's alibi. In it. We're back to square one. We're almost out of time. Huh? Is something the matter? I am the program of the security camera. The data from around 4 o'clock yesterday has vanished. What? Are you serious? I think whoever stole the data is the real culprit. You wouldn't know anything about this, would you? Maybe. 
Around 10 p.m. last night, there was a strange Navi that was poking around. Maybe that Navi. What did the Navi look like? Um, well, he was pretty tall. I don't remember anything else. Pretty tall? That doesn't tell us very much. Eggman, if that Navi, Navi was here, then maybe the Navi's operator was caught on film by the, this camera. No good, Lan. Everything after 4 p.m. yesterday has been raised. According to Miss. Wait. No, look. You. You. Ding bat. Look at 10 p.m., not 4. Like. Look at the day before. Not what was. Oh, you're an idiot, Mega Man. And then all the. What? Then erase all traces of that they were ever here. This person is one sneaky rascal. I see. Um, excuse me. I don't know why you need that data from yesterday, but would you like the data from the day before yesterday? Sorry, but I don't need the data. We really need to see data from yesterday. Oh, I see. It is really old data, but there was something unusual in it. Something unusual? Nothing really useful here. Hold on. Ah, here we are. Just Mick. Him being in the classroom isn't strange. What's with him? Real fidgety. Hey, you, come here. There's something weird. There's, there's some weird thing going here. Oh, I know what this is leading up to. It's a security bot. What's Mick up to now? He's gonna. He's gonna screw around. He's screwing. Around. Look, something strange is in this closet. I tell you. Aren't you a security bot? Aren't you supposed to protect the school? Well, then do your job. I understand. So he's fooling around. He's being a bully to the security bots. Look real closely. I'm gonna kick him in, isn't he? I don't see anything strange. Ah, oh, come on. You're not looking hard enough. It's here. Okay, so my guess is that um, he, he's just being a putz. It just threw up and it, it trapped the and trapped a security bot in there. So the security bot most likely would have seen who the culprit is. <laughs> I guess the security bot. I'm gonna tell everyone all about it. It's just another one of his pranks. I tell Mr. Mock he's gonna get in trouble again. Anyway, this has nothing to do with Dad. <sighs> We're almost out of time. Mega Man, let's try to think of another plan. Yeah, check to see if the the bot. Check to see if the bot has security footage. Huh? Yeah, it's still in there. Hmm, now that I think about it, I think it might have heard something something during class. So this bot's been in here for two days now. You know, wait, you know I'm, or wait, you know I'm here, huh? I guess you can see me from inside there. Well, let's get you out of there. Hmm, there's a strange lock here. Here we go. <laughs> <sighs> it was simply awful. <sighs> hey, are you okay? Ah. What are you doing here? I've been looking for you for two days. Did you hide him here, Lan? No. Really? Really. I don't know. Sounds kind of fishy. Are you hiding the truth from me? I'll, if you're, or if you're hiding the truth from me, I'll know soon enough. The security bot records everything it seems, so it'll be on record. One look at the video, and I'll know the culprit. Wait, did you just? What did you just say, Mr. Mock? I said the thing that the security bot records everything it sees. What's wrong, Lan? Why the serious face? Don't tell me you were the one to hide the bot. Record, Mega Man. Maybe. Yeah, this security bot has has been in the closet for two days. Which meant that it may have been able to look out into the classroom and record everything we need. Mr. Rock, where, where's the rec recorded data uh, stored for this bot? Um, the robot control in the PC room and the teacher room, but you go in there, no pranks, understand? Thank you, Mr. Mock. With this data, maybe we can back up Dad's alibi. Alright. So, to the teacher's room. Alright, what am I looking for? Well, I've got... Oh, yeah, whatever. You're not... I don't need you. Um... Lance, send me into this computer. I'll look for the video... Oh, wait. So we gotta, we gotta go all the way to the... 
back where we fought uh, Burn or Blast Man. Burn Man! <laughs> that was two games ago. All right. I guess. Uh, wait, no, we're not gonna. We're not that far away. Yeah, it's just right there. All right. Land. The video data that the security bot took should be here. Well then, Mega Man, it's up to you to find the data of what the security bot saw at 4 p.m. yesterday from inside the closet. I hope it recorded something. It did. And it got a very interesting perspective, considering it was inside the closet. Just as we thought the bot could see in, uh, into the classroom. Now where's the footage of Dad? <clears throat> I don't know, maybe it could link up to the cameras. There he is! There's Dad. Alright, Lan, with this, we can prove Dad's innocent. Yeah. Okay, let's hurry to the courthouse with this data. Wait. What, Megan? We gotta hurry. Maybe the security bot saw more one very important thing. Yeah, maybe he saw the person that jacked their Navi into the security camera and erased all the data from four, after 4 p.m. In other words, they may have saw the real culprit. Here's the video from last night. There's no one there. Wait, I can hear footsteps. Somebody's coming. What? Huh? What? Why is prosecuted? Why is the prosecutor here? What's going on? I don't want to believe it, but there's only one answer. No way. It looks like it. A real culprit of the incident is the prosecutor. The person that framed Dad is him. But why? Why would the prosecutor do something like this? I'd like to know too. But right now, they we're out of time. Let's hurry up and get this data over to the courthouse. Yeah! Mega Man got image data. Alright! Now we gotta get back to the judge tree, and I'm gonna do another cut. Alright, here we go. Court will not be in session today. Do you have some business here? You know, where is your cheery hawk? Your ah, where's Dad? The criminal Hikari should be already in the punishment room. He's already he, he should receive his sentence shortly. Why do you want to know? His alibi. Your cheery Hikari has now had an alibi. Is that so? Yes, the, it's the truth. Hmm. I believe you. I'll make an exception this time. You may go into the punishment room. Dad! Looks like we made it. Dad, can you hear me? We're gonna get you out of here right now. Is that you, Lan? I'm okay, so don't do anything rash, okay? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? What about the zapping? The punishment will begin in 20 minutes. Begin preparations. 20 minutes? We gotta hurry. Hey, quiet! Silence is golden in the punishment room. Duct tape is silver. Hey, mister, please listen. Dad's punishment, real culprit. So, hey, calm down, kid. Now, what's wrong? My dad, I found evidence that supports Yurichiro Hikari's... I still can't pronounce it. Yurichiro... Yurichiro... That is a hard name to pronounce for me. I can prove he's innocent! I wonder. But, no. If you really did, then that means we found an innocent person guilty! He would be the first green in, he'd be the first in Greentown. You gotta stop the punishment now. Well, you can't do that from here. You have to get permission from the judge tree. Alright, I'll show the judge pre judge tree the proof and stop the punishment. Oh wait, what's down here? Absolutely nothing. Oh well, that's our sweet. I was... You Prosecutor Ito. Ah, oh, Lan. Did you find something to support your dad's alibi? If you didn't, it may turn pretty bad for him soon. I found some. It's a recording of a real culprit. What's wrong, Prosecutor? I see. I've been unmasked. So you really did? Yes. The story about your dad's hacking was a lie. But you didn't fall for it. Not even the... Not even the... Tr Wait. Not even the trap in the security camera. And come to think of it, why did the punishment robot suddenly stop at that time? Or stop that time? What? 
Come to think of it, why did the punishment robot suddenly stop that time? I don't know. I've underestimated you. Or was it that my traps were too easy? So, all of this was you? Prosecutor Ito, why would you do frame my dad? Because I have my orders. People in high places make easy targets. The same with your navy, your your navy skills, your dad, and his brains. You stand to lose a lot when you have a lot. And you're going to lose it all to the organization. Organization? You can't... Yeah, the organization has caused you so much trouble. No! Then why did you sentence Captain Blackbeard? Ah, that was because he failed in this mission. Failure is not in a, a tolerated organization. I bumped my Xbox here and turned it on, so whatever. Anyone who fails is removed. That is our rule. Then you really... Yes. My role in the organization is to remove nuisances to, uh, to us in a lawful way. That is why I cannot... I can... That's why I cannot take back your dad's sentence. I think our chat is over. Do it, Judge Tree. If we do this, we won't have to hide anymore. Pronounce that every person in Cyber City is guilty, and then convict this troublesome boy as a felon. So as we can see, the, the Judge Tree can be corrupted. I will now pass judgment! I pronounce everyone guilty! Of what?! Lan, it's too dangerous. You'll get zapped. For now, I think we better get out of here. Yes, you're right. Whoa. Everyone, come along quietly. Do not resist arrest. What's going on? I haven't done anything wrong. Well, I guess I do like to sneak food here and there. I don't remember doing anything that, that was that bad. Tell me what I did wrong. No, help me. What's going to happen to all of us? Makes just sit there running in circles. <laughs> Are they following us? What's going on? They're probably barricading themselves in there. As long as they have the judge tree, the prosecutor can do whatever he wants. I don't think he wants. To, uh, I don't think he wants anyone else near that tree. We really planned this well. What should we do? What's going to happen to Dad? And everyone else? Well, it looks like the prosecutor is manipulating the judge tree, and that the tree commands the punishment robots. I'd say that there's only one thing we can do. We gotta pull the plug on the judge tree. If we do that, we can save Dad and stop the punishment robots. Yeah, we gotta find a way to get close to that tree. We can't just go in through the front door. Trying to slip by the punishment robots is too risky. But, but if we don't get in there now, they might be they might start Dad's punishment. Let's look for another way in. We gotta find a way in to get near the judge tree. Um somewhere outside. Mikey? Um Yeah, it sure looks like there's yeah, there's a path of some kind out there. Um, uh I just, yeah, I saw that door there. Uh yeah, it looks like we just gotta go this way. What the heck? Oh, okay, I'm to open this door, please enter the password. The law governing net navy rights is what law number? Oh, no. oh, let me guess. I gotta go. <sighs> okay, never mind. So, yeah. That door. Okay, that's not the same door as the brown one. So I gotta. Gotta go talk to the freaking lawyers of navvies again. Wait a minute. I went right by the computer. And... I'm, I'm an idiot. Alright, let's jack in here real quick. Good thing is, I don't have to go very far. Hmm. So sneaking at. Yes, I... Oh, my God. Don't care. Ah, you're here. Lawyers in the making. And Abby Wright. Yes, they do have those, and they are covered up in Greentown Law number 153, I believe. That's the kind of zeal we're studying for. I'm so pleased. Okay, good. We have the number, 153. Pretty gate. All right. Open the door. The net Abby is what number? Enter the password. There we go. You may proceed. There it is. I think the tree's dead if it's got all that machinery in there. Is that it? The judge tree's roots? That's gotta be it. Land. You gotta find a way to port uh, to find, or you gotta find a port to jack me in. And then, uh, and then all stops the judge tree. Got it. 
Um, well, I think we just gotta climb up the ladder here. Go up the ladder? Yep. This is inside the courtroom. That means... Well, he better not notice me. Prosecutor Ito! Oh, way to go, Lan. Way to blow your cover. Hey, Lan, what are you doing over there? What do you think you're gonna do? I'm gonna stop the judge tree. Stop? <laughs> I suppose I, I, I suppose you can access the judge tree from the control panel in the front of you, but you should give up, Lan. My Navi judge man is in that tree. On top of that, there's one more guest in that tree today. And that Navi is very powerful and very evil indeed. Prosecutor Ito, I don't get it. You were so cool during the trial. And you have such a great sense of justice. <laughs> sense of justice? I gave up on justice a long time ago. But why? Long time ago when I was young, I thought I'm gonna put all the bad people in jail. But you see, Lan, no matter how many bad people you lock away, there are always new criminals to take their place. Yes, I realize the horrible truth. As long as there are humans on this earth, there will be always be people there will always be crime. It doesn't matter what we do or what the rules we make. And so I lost my faith in justice around the time that the organization found me. And I was reborn. I figured that the humans could make perfect sense of or I figured that if humans couldn't make the perfect society, then I might as well destroy it. <clears throat> That's messed up. I can't see how this all makes sense at all. That's because you're still a child. You'll understand when you grow up. But I guess we'll have to. Well, but I guess we'll have. We'll have remade the world by then. I really, really respected you, and then thought you were really cool. But now I can see I was wrong about you. So I will. I will stop you, and I will with, with everything I have. Let's go, Mega Man. Jack in. Execute. With that said, guys, I'm going to go ahead and stop here. So if you guys like this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I'll see you all in the next video. So thank you very much for watching. God bless you all. See you in the next one.